is Shelly from HodgePodge Hoosiers. We've got rain coming this afternoon, so I wanted to get out here and get our peppers planted. I'm gonna put two peppers in this little bed. It's a four foot by two foot, I believe. And what you see on the top of it is I put sprinkled Epsom salt and then a light vegetable fertilizer and then some azomite. And all I do, it's already been limed. I limed it earlier, a couple weeks back, so it would get all settled in. I just scratch it out so it isn't, you know, it's evenly distributed instead of putting it all into one plant. To where it looks like that. And then I'll just dig a hole, put some water in it. I got two bells, a California Wonder, to go in this one. And then the other one, on the other side of the garden, I've got coral bells. And they're up here. So I'll do the same thing to this one. We did get 18, I believe, of our tomato plants out yesterday. I'm fighting allergies, so I still got to do that bed over there and then the little one. So my tomato plants wasn't looking that good. So I'm hoping putting them out here. Their root systems was great. So I'm hoping this is gonna help them to grow. I've got Abe Lincoln's in this one, beef steaks in this one, and this long bed here is, they're called 42 Day. And they're all new varieties for me. So I hope they work out. We tried in my gardener seeds this year. So we're hoping that we're gonna get a lot of tomatoes. Last year we only did the beds on the end over there with tomatoes. So we've added this one because I like to can up as much salsa and juice and just regular tomato sauce, make tomato powder as much as I can for the off months. So we don't have to buy any tomato products from the store. So I'm going to get those put in. Like I said, I'm just going to dig a hole and I'll ruffle the plant roots just a little, set them in there and put a little water and cover them up. And we're all, we are going to put a cage around them. I don't have them out right now. They're small yet, so we've got a little bit of time. So I'll show you what it looks like when it gets done. Already finished. It just took a few minutes and I've got my California Wonder Bell Peppers in this one. Like I said, all I did was dug a hole, ruffled the, ref, the roots a little bit and covered them up. And then here is my coral bells. I'm hoping this year I'm going to take this variety of pepper and I'm going to try and make my own paprika. Something new out of my wheelhouse. But I want to try it. But all of our items that we're needing for our drip irrigation is supposed to be in today. But we do have rain all afternoon. So hopefully we're going to be starting it tomorrow. Now once we get the drip in, I'll be covering the tomato beds with pine straw. We've got pine straw put up from our trees this past year or my father-in-law's trees mostly. We have some up there. And then I'll cover that up. Strawberries are coming out. We bought bare roots. We actually got them off of Amazon. Every one of them is starting to turn green. So I'm happy about that. Should be having strawberries soon, or at least this winter. This, excuse me, this summer. Can't talk today. But anyway, all I gotta get yet is these two beds for sweet potato slips. I've got all the sweet potato slips for the Beauregard variety that is gonna go in one bed. We've actually ordered a new variety. It's gonna be a white sweet potato. Those will be in the middle of May and they're gonna go in this bed. And we're excited to try a new kind. The Beauregard is native to our area. I'd really like to try the purples sometime. I think they're called Okin Okinawas, but maybe next year. They're just a tad on the expensive side. So 
that'll be coming in the future. This is our cucumbers. Everything's needing a drink, so we're hoping that the rain does that. And then the irrigation, we can get it in, and then so there won't be no more top watering anymore. The drip will do it. So I think that's going to do it for today. This is Shelly from HodgePodge Hoosiers. I hope you all have a great week. And until next time, bye for now.